on the app. You got to cut that whole part out. Man, Jesus voted Christ. the number one black show amongst black children who were breastfed for too long <laughs> and played with their mama's titty. Shut the fuck up. I played my mama's titty. <laughs> she was sucking one and playing with the other. <laughs> Put the other one out. <laughs> wow. You ain't coming no more. That's why this show's so me. strong. <laughs> this whole show raised on uh, breast milk. Nah. Shut up. I ain't had no breast milk. I was selling crack. And that's crazy. She, you know she loved you. She breastfed you with one nipple. <laughs> a lot of work on one titty. Oh, okay. Uh, she was with me uh, when I got shot. Oh, damn. Damn. They both was. He was in Pampers in the, in the, in the car. Sleep. Damn. I wonder if these white people who be having you on their show be thinking you playing when you say this shit. You ever seen they face, they don't know the laugh, they be like... <laughs> They be shocked. Yeah, exactly. I'm like, they do not know she is not bullshit. But let me give you a dope ass introduction because you deserve one. Today, on. ladies and gentlemen, we Come have on. a very special guest, a hilarious comedian, Come on. a friend of the family. She remember when we was in the trap trap. Now she done goddamn manifested a whole Come on. new lifestyle. She done pulled up stunning on me. <laughs> Come on. My birthday twin. Come on. The most hilarious. Got one of the best shows out on TV right now. Take your ass and go watch, go watch it. it. The Miss Pat on. show on BET Holding Plus. Holding it down. Holding it down. Yeah. None other than Miss Pat. Yeah. <laughs> ATL Fine. <laughs> What's up, movie star, superstar, TV star? <laughs> What's How good? you living? I'm living. It's it's good out here. I'm having fun. I seen you back on stage too. Yeah, I'm 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 um I'm finishing up the uh, clubs and I'm getting ready to move into theaters. So I'm doing my first theater tour called uh, Your Girl Done Made It. Hell yeah, yeah, she did. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Um, Speaking of love, let me do the white people shit. Miss Pat, your crowd work. Oh my god. <laughs> It's amazing. I've <laughs> been seeing the clips that you've been dropping from the club performances, and that's that's been one of the fan favorites. I don't know if you notice or not, but when it you is. Ask, you, I, think, I see at the end of the show, you leave a little space where you can fuck with the crowd and let them talk to you and, and, and things of that nature. I, I, I just, I like, I like, I call it crowd chronicle, because, yeah. you know, people always like to, when they see you on TV, they like to holler shit out from TV. So one day I say, I'm just going to talk to the crowd when I finish. And, you know, I want people to know, I do an hour and a half before I even get to that fucking crowd work. Right. And they really like it. You find out what's on people's mind, you find out what people are going through, and you get, I, I'm able to capture some really funny shit, you know. Hell yeah. Um, just running my mouth to regular people. And I also make you feel, when they see you on TV, they almost feel like you're not human. And I think they're human me to, to the audience. They're like, oh, yeah. she, she really act like she is on TV. I'm like, bitch, it's me out 24-7. You right. make it real. You I know try, what I'm I yeah. try. What's the wildest shit that's happened doing one of them? Um, I think I asked for a nurse, and this lady stood up and said, I'm a nurse. I said, what kind of nurse? She said, a CNA. I said, bitch, sit down. You clean up. <laughs> 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 no fucking I'm nurse. I'm going to be finishing the summer. <laughs> But I mean, I enjoy it. I'm enjoying it. Um, you know, I'm finally moving into theaters. That's a, that's a big jump. Mm -hmm. So that's some work, and yeah. I'm, I'm excited about that. It ain't nothing actually, like I'm them with the clubs, same people though. who took take you out. Um, um, Outback. Outback. I'm with oh, Outback. Oh, them motherfuckers be everywhere. Yeah, I'm with Outback. So. They doing they doing my first tour, so I'm excited. Oh, you with the right people? Yeah. yeah. They gonna make sure that money there. You know, that's one of the reasons why I chose them, because I know they had taken y'all out several yeah, times yeah. On, out, on tour. So I was like, well, Carlo fuck with him, and I ain't seen that negative on, online. I guess I'll fuck with him, too. I don't too. got shit negative to say. They be like, Carlos, whatever you want to do, man, just fucking let me know. Yeah, so, you know, we we, work, we just started partnering up, and then I'm going to go into finish this year out, and then I'm going to go into next year with them. So... Looking forward to it. And the show getting bigger and crazy. bigger. It, it is. Show. It is. And I'm seeing the growth. You were actually in there. You done relaxed <laughs> and you just letting that shit flow. And I love the chemistry that you got with Tammy Roman. Oh, Like, yeah. you would have thought that y'all was real sisters the way that y'all able to build that shit on, on the set like that. And the way it come across is so real. Yeah. You know, people really love me and Tammy together. Hell yeah. And, and I've said this a million times, you know, my the co-creator, Jordan Cooper, you know, he had her from day one, her and the daddy. And he was like, I'm telling y'all gonna go great together. Uh, shout out to Tammy. She just had a birthday, too. And both of us the same fucking 
different people. Right. So I'm like, we both Aries, we both strong. How the fuck this gonna work? And I didn't know Tammy from reality shows. So when I, when she's fucking a dope ass actress. Yeah. That motherfucker don't drop no lines. And I'm sitting there, and I know I'm the and star. Her story is incredible. Oh, her yeah. story is also incredible. Cause a lot of times what I write, she it, it hits home for her. Right. And you know, like the third season, we did a whole thing about my mama boyfriend molesting me, and you know she shared some you know things like what she been through in life, and you you can tell when some when Tammy is acting, or uh, if she if she experienced something, and I and I always tell the co-creators, I was, I was like she been here before, but that motherfucker can act her ass off, and people people really think Tammy Roman is my fucking sister. I gotta ask you this, cause. You drop, you say shit in conversation that be heavy as fuck, that people be like, and then some, my mom, boy, like, how do you deal with these traumatic ass, heavy ass subjects with a smile like this? You know, I, I tell people all the time, you take the darkest shit and you laugh at it. So I don't let shit get me down. I just say it. And the, the thing about trauma and, and dark shit, people just scared to say it out loud. Or they like, oh, you know, I don't want you to feel sorry for me. I want you to laugh at when I say I've been molested because other people been through the same thing. But when you crying about it and you dwelling over it, it's got control of you. Ain't shit controlling me, I'm free. I don't get mad at their daddy because he shot me in the head. That nigga live in a rooming house. I'm winning. Why shouldn't I tell the story? Why shouldn't you? You know, if a motherfucker held you down or did you wrong, what you gonna cry for? I can't change the past, but I can, I can damn sure enough control the future. Man, I love that. That's it. Because the shit we just been sitting here, just, you know, in regular conversation, and then you drop some heavy shit like that, I know the people, like that could really help somebody who watches yeah. it. Like just to hear somebody say that, like you said, could could just be that that one that make them change however they feel about whatever they done been through. And I get that all the time. You know, people people thank me for being an open-minded mom with a gay daughter. People thank me for telling my story because she played so with many, your too. She did not want my mom's titties. <laughs> <laughs> I not. ain't never letting this shit go. <laughs> she she already said it. Titty. She grew up on the titty ass. Hell no. <laughs> She wrote my motherfucking tip. <laughs> <laughs> what she say? She said, my titties now. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. That nigga bitch you live with, them your titties. She live with her. Oh, That's nigga a bitch. whole nother. <laughs> <laughs> she live with a nigga bitch. Them your titties. These are not these your daddy titties. So you do call her your son-in-law or what's they pronouns? Everything. <laughs> him, them, day, and he. <laughs> she, she like them big bitches, look like basketball players that didn't make it to the NBA. Oh, for real? Yeah, she like, oh, oh, you like oh, oh girlfriend player. look like him. For real? Well, she, like, she can just fuck with him. <laughs> she like a creative player. <laughs> you ain't wasting time trying to find bitches that look like these. This nigga's already out here. Where you gonna find somebody that's six seven? Her girlfriend talk, all them bitches look like Clay. Light skin, big marriage. bitch with the sagging pants. Only thing they ain't got is Clay ain't got the weight. That's oh, they it. thick too. They thick too. They be trying to hide the ass. Yeah, they look like they could have dunked if they lost weight. Damn. Who's trying to hide the ass and baggy shit? You know the the crazy part. I just wish she get married. That's what I wish. To she a would woman. Do. To whatever. Oh. Whatever they want to call themselves. Oh. Cause she she's almost four. Oh, what, what you, you don't fuck with them and they. Huh? You don't fuck with them. <laughs> them days either. She like she like she like bitches like y'all. What the fuck that mean, Miss <laughs> Pat? <laughs> you not for not for the trial. No, 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 I'm not saying. Hey, bitches like us. <laughs> she like bitches y'all, like y'all, you know. So you know, she like a little pretty loud no, bitch. No. Got, got, got something going for themselves. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about little bitches with veins in their neck and shit, you know? What the fuck you no, mean, Miss Pat? I mean, she like, she like rough neck, like, like, you know, she like men, bitches. Oh. Yeah, yeah, studs. 
Yeah, she oh. always end up being with a cool bitch like you, Carlo. <laughs> <laughs> a cool bitch like Carlo. Miss Nice Charlo. Miss Nice Charlo. Oh shit! Just treat me any. Miss Nice Charlo. Just treat me any old kind of goddamn way when she come up here. But her girlfriend is actually way bigger than you. She probably can dunk that. on you and everything. I believe it. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I mean, but and then I think that's why people, you know, really gravitate Now I'm gonna show up show. at their house with my shirt off. Bitch, it's Carlos, you and me, cool bitch. <laughs> well, you know they're getting their titties removed. We ain't gonna know that's you. What? They hate us that much? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Dude, they hate us that much. <laughs> they, <laughs> I don't think she ever been with a girl who had a booze removed, but, you know, but, but back to the sh- but back to the show, I think that's what they like, because we talk about, we get really heavy with a with a way to make shit funny. And I like how y'all sprinkle just enough cussing in the show. Thank you. That love, it. it's just like, that shit, that's what made the shit pop, you know what I'm saying? It's uh-huh. like, because they, it ain't like y'all just cussing up a storm, it's like, Y'all saying the right shit in the right moments. Like and when, when people right. would, would be, right. yeah, that shit hit to me. Yeah. Some adult shit, how grown people talk. Well, that's why we call it a grown folk sitcom. It's the first sitcom to ever do it. Yep. It, yeah. it, I guarantee somebody white gonna come along and do it, and it's gonna blow up, it's gonna be that friend. This and summer on CBS, my fucking dad. <laughs> uh-huh. And then they gonna be like, they gonna act like they created it. No, we did it first. Right. Yeah, we did it first. That's, oh, that's hard. I, I'm just thankful that you know BET Plus, you know, understood what we was trying to do. Yeah. And they allowed us to do it because that show got shopped a lot. It's not easy making a show. I'm quite sure y'all know yeah. that. It got shopped a lot. Yours was in the works for a while, man. Five years. Yeah. Five years. And, and plus, you done made it out of that. That area, we know, like that first season, they like you don't know if you're coming back. Mm-hmm. And then the second mm-hmm. season, like we still don't know. Now you in season you four, hit. and they know what you Bro. can do with it. So yeah. it's like, and I've been peeping y'all pay homage to a lot of the other sitcoms. Yes, we do. With the people you have on there, we had Molly how Gibbs. That, how did that feel to be able to do that, man? It and Molly Gibbs on there cussing. Yeah, you know what? They, <laughs> <laughs> you probably didn't even have to tell her to do it. No, but when we asked her, we wanted her. Well, the co-creator wanted her to say bitch, and she said, "I'm not gonna call a black woman a bitch, but I say everything else." And boy, did she say everything. Some shit right. got cut out, but she said everything else. It was like I was like even when we worked with the mama from um, the Fresh. Friends. Mm-hmm. And uh, I was, I remember standing on set like, I'm on set with these people? That's how I look at it. You know, like, we did Jaleel, uh, Jaleel White Urkel. Mm-hmm. And, and you know, sometimes, I'm not gonna say I kind of get starstruck, but I have to, I take a moment to say, damn, I'm here with these people. I grew up watching these people right. do their thing on TV. They there here. with you, though. Well, they're they're, 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 they're on my show. The mutual respect. Yeah, and you know, yeah. now people, you know, at first, people kind of shied away from the show because it was something different. And But when I'm out at the Emmys, I was like, hey, I want to work with you. I wanna, I'm like, you want to be on a, a, a cussing sitcom? But we have a good time. We do it in front of a live studio audience. It's like old fucking multicam. Mm-hmm. You know, we, we get 150, 200 people over there and we have a ball every Friday. Talk about that. They don't do that a lot no more. No, what? because they went to Can Laughter. Mm-hmm. They went to Can Laughter, and, you know, they don't, uh, they don't, when, I, when we was in L.A. and we were shooting the pilot, I remember saying, we went from set to set, different people were shooting pilot, and they literally hired laughter, laughters. And I was like, what the fuck is this? I couldn't believe it. And I just told my co-creator, I said, nigga, we ain't hiring no motherfucking laughter. These niggas gonna laugh at this shit. We gonna rewrite it till we find something funny. And we did the two episodes on the pilot, and they killed. And, you know, Hulu shot the pilot and didn't pick it up. Shout out to Hulu. I ain't mad. I love y'all. But then BT picked it up. And we and in Atlanta, they didn't shoot live shows. So this is the first one sitcom with an audience. So we had to build. The first time, the first episode, the second episode we shot, we had 30 people. And the sound wasn't working. It was fucking a nightmare. Damn. But we worked to get it right. Now, last year, last season, we had to turn away people. So many people were showing up. Yeah. And people really enjoyed the show. They feel like it's finally a black woman 
that represent somebody in their family. Everybody ain't got no fucking college degree. Everybody ain't got no motherfucker, a doctor or a lawyer. Mm -hmm. But I'm that hood red aunt. I'm that mama. I'm that grandmama that say whatever the fuck she want to say. And black people and white people and everybody appreciate it. Right. Mm -hmm. You do get that auntie vibe like you live smoking the house. No, nah, you don't smoke my motherfucking house call. I ain't Ooh. coming over there with that old bullshit, dude. Nah, you, you, you let you everything what? else go you on over there. Ashley running bitches all in and out the house. <laughs> <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> she in the bathroom bleaching her ass over there. It's a man. It's a free one. But I like a little piece of reefer. A little piece of reefer. Now I got to step outside and all this old country ass shit. Hey, what's up, Chicago? It's your man Carlos Miller, July the 21st. I will be in the city full up on me man you know i'm gonna be at the riviera theater man so you know put your little clean ass outfit on make sure your lady looking good and pull up on your folks man we're gonna have a good time we're talking good shit chicago that's july the 21st come check up on me we're gonna be cleaner than a mug in there come see me at the end of the day i'm on tour so just make sure you get the tickets and I let me, you know, just come have a good time. I'll see you when I get there. This episode is sponsored by BetterHelp. Hey, what's up? It's Carlos Miller. It can be easy to get caught up in what everyone else needs from you and never take a moment to think about what you need for yourself. But when you spend all of your time giving, it can leave us feeling stretched, thin, and burned out. Therapy can give you the tools you need to find more balance in your life so you can keep supporting others without leaving yourself behind. If you're thinking of starting therapy, give BetterHelp a try. It's entirely online, designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited to your schedule. Just fill out a brief questionnaire to get matched with a licensed therapist and switch therapists at any time for no additional charge. Find more balance with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash 85South today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash 85South. Because what they doing no smell. <laughs> right. <laughs> Except the asshole boy, that dude, that bad bro. <laughs> the bleach not the smell out. What's your name? <laughs> Quisha. <laughs> she got about 16 kids. I know, the pussy look good. I can tell by that mouth, that pussy good. <laughs> it looks like she a got that, make she got pussy that square look good. smile. <laughs> <laughs> what? No, you the do not. Out? You gonna show, you Let me see, Ashley, we'll wrap later on. Cause I, man, you, every hey. time we start building, here come your mama one to the heaven. Oh, one nipple show up and kill the fuck. <laughs> Wait a minute, you got Quisha for job on your phone? No the fuck out. Quisha, get my number. Bitch, I didn't write your pussy. I don't want to see your motherfucking go. What? Quisha. I ain't gonna say her. What what the I don't want to it. Yeah, you do. <laughs> <laughs> Quisha, you got you on the Wi-Fi, Quisha. <laughs> Everybody's phone gonna pop up on the Wi-Fi. Somebody put Quisha, hey, man, put her in the group chat. <laughs> no, she got a man. She got a, ain't nobody asked to be her man. <laughs> Damn. I don't know, what make y'all? <laughs> this nigga asked for pictures. He, he literally, uh, <laughs> man, don't take it so That's literal. That's the nigga right? with a little ponytail asking y'all for pictures. Yeah, that nigga. <laughs> he, we got him off the streets. Uh-huh. Yeah. That nigga was running a gang, and we turned his life he around. He was in a gang? He was in a gang. Was he with him? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. I mean, he, a, he look like a rag dog on that. But you, I bet you up on all that hair, he a good looking nigga. If you shave that nigga down Every, to the No, bone, don't do this. Every time you come here, you leave somebody who work here fucked up. Last time it was Chad. <laughs> Chad? No, he does not he ain't fucking in, in there. <laughs> leave Joe alone. He, he, not... <laughs> he quit. No. No. He oh. here, he just ain't in here with you. You already feel him last time. Yeah. I didn't say shit to him. You called him a little bitch and everything. You told him you a, huh? you told him you a stuff him in your pussy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. You don't remember the shit you said to Chad? They did. I was looking for him today. I yeah, was like, no, what and then his he ass is over the there. He ain't here. He got in the office and got up under the desk. I'm yeah, he sorry, in the Chad. office. He back there. He kept hollering by his woman. Is he still with her? You fucked that up. <laughs> <laughs> 
she saw some of that and like, I, you let her talk about me like that. Wait a minute, he, she, he ain't one of them all. I, that ain't my business to be discussing on camera like that. On, you know, I hate a nigga who brag on a bitch all the time. You ain't gotta tell, he's like, my mom, I'm not, nigga, I'm not trying to fuck you. I don't even know <laughs> what he look like. See, I shouldn't have brought it up. I'm sorry, Chad. I'm sorry, and I hope your relationship lasts. I feel you, man. <laughs> We're gonna have to change the subject, because you actually rubbed on that titty. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm just bullying. Oh, we gotta get out of there. You gotta get out of there. Ashley, what you say about that booty? <laughs> <laughs> How many kids you got, Miss Pet? I have four kids and two abortions. <laughs> You ever think about the two that didn't make it? I told them if they come back when I get some money, I was gonna keep them. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm a good mama. Wow. Some bitches out here kill their kids and don't claim. I claim everybody. Mm. I had one miscarriage, her name was Jasmine, so they bought me a cabbage pack kid to replace her. Mm. So at four, Five, you, think six, when, you think if you get to heaven, all the kids that you're in keep gonna be like, there go my mama right there. I'm gonna say, boy, back up, I don't know you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they not gonna be like, there go my mama. They be like, oh, <laughs> did you have fun? <laughs> Look who finally <laughs> showed up. I'm like, oh, did you have fun? I returned your ass. <laughs> 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 I don't understand why this country gonna tell us we can't have no abortion. In my pussy. I don't either. In my pussy. It's Everybody, it's everything ain't keepable. It if ain't. you could be able to go back and return shit to a front store at Walmart, you should be able to return a baby if you don't want one. Yeah. Or you should at least, <laughs> you should at least get approved for yeah. one. You go down there, you got a valid reason. They should just be like, all right. I'm, I'm serious. I mean, and I'm, I'm not saying, I say, I say do you when you see this. But it's nothing wrong with getting an abortion. This is my body. Nobody fucking owns me. I should be able to talk about my abortion openly. This is, I do what the fuck I want to do. First of all, why are you getting involved when you ain't the motherfucking daddy or the baby that we killing? You know, you ain't even the motherfucking daddy. You want to act like you care. I ain't the daddy. And I'm going to act like I care. You care? I, what? Uh-uh, I'm, I believe that the woman should make the choice. It's her body. That's right, it's my body, it's my right. You you not there to hold my pad when my period come on. That's too deep. <laughs> That's too deep, Miss Pat. You shouldn't want nobody to do, do that. Do y'all hold your pad? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you just put that bitch on. <laughs> you gotta hold that bitch in place to hold that? God damn, <laughs> Nigga, sometimes I'm sorry, baby, I didn't know you had to hold the pad. Hold. <laughs> sometimes they come with belts. It's so much shit we don't know about pussies, bruh. I'm just saying, you know, it, it's, it's a woman rights to do what the fuck she want to do. That's By the right. time you say you have an abortion, people want to look down on you like it's something wrong. It's nothing fucking wrong with getting an abortion. You do you. Don't you let nobody tell you what the fuck. If, if, let me tell you something. If they ain't telling us to stop plastic surgery, why the fuck they going to do something else? Mm -hmm. That shit is out of hand. Mm -hmm. More asses are put on women than babies are being killed in this country. I don't even know why. I don't know why they buy asses. They buy asses so you can look, Carlos. You don't like fake booties? No. I don't like shit fake. Do you like scratch marks on bitches? Yeah. yeah. Mm. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Damn, I should've came here with my stomach out. You should've. <laughs> it depends on where the stretch marks are. Yeah. No, just what? <laughs> what they doing? What they doing? Is it a few of them or is a lot of them look like, like a pack of bacon you laid across? You don't like the scratch marks in bitches' chest? What is it? In the chest. Is it from getting on big? On the titties? All the way down the stomach. Is it from the titties? <laughs> <laughs> you tiger stripes. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, Miss Pat. I don't want to make a blanket statement, but I mean, some some uh, some stretch marks in the right place. What is the right place? The motherfuckers be hitting, like, like on the ass. Boy, that shit look like thunder and lightning. <laughs> oh, wait. He said it ass look like thunder and lightning. Yeah, but like right mouth. here, right here on the little th on the little mm -hmm. thighs. Some people got them in the chest, have, on yeah, their titties, that's where it's up supposed under to be. their arms. Then like right on behind the leg with the ass in set. between. Yeah, all that. Stretch that. Okay, you you want a bitch look like your mom and auntie. That's yeah. normal places though. Yeah, I want that's normal access. places that's supposed to. Nigga, stretch. that Walmart fan is fucking my eyes up. That mother got Ms. me over Pat, here crying. Just 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 turn it the other way. Yes, so. Lord. At least you ain't hot no more. 
I had a hot flash, but these motherfuckers fucking me up over here. That little motherfucking nine dollars. You want water or something? Nah, I don't want no motherfucking Dr. Pepper, I can tell you that. Right, boy, I was gonna give you one of them, so you ain't gotta worry about that. <laughs> you can give me this motherfucking schoolgirl water. <laughs> you a schoolgirl? <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I dropped out real early. Yeah, but you used to be. Mm -mm. You was over there by the school. <laughs> <laughs> I did, elementary. When you dropped out? Eighth grade. Shit, it wasn't even hard then. <laughs> <laughs> shit, shit don't get hard about my brain, God damn. <laughs> what, what the fuck you talking about hard, you wiener? No, I'm saying school wasn't even hard about name grade. Oh, yeah, but I had gotten pregnant with Ashley, so I, I dropped out. Who, oh, I ain't even going, I don't even want to talk about Ashley no more. <laughs> yeah. The shit, she's, I thought you said some shit. She be saying some shit, too. I didn't even know about Ashley until one day I was on Instagram and I saw a picture and I said, damn, it's two Miss Pats. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, that's the hardest part about having a gay daughter because she be on there kissing them bitches and it be my face. <laughs> <laughs> you so gonna be in the tabloids. I be taking, bitch, get my face out the bitch on Instagram. That's, that's You be doing all that in public. Kissing all on these, all in the mouth and all that. Well, you know what? I'm gonna have to get a separate interview. I got to bring you on here because you you got this shit to say. You got a story to tell. Do what? She do. She ain't got no story to give. You this crazy? Is she gonna fuck around and blow up this Atlanta? <laughs> and she gave, She gonna make it way faster you than said, you think she is. You <laughs> said she was with you when you got shot in the titty. She was. Both yeah, of them was. He story. was too. He just don't remember shit. She picked your nipple up. She didn't pick my motherfucking nipple up. <laughs> Mama, I got your titty! As <laughs> <laughs> gay as she was. <laughs> I had to push my baby out of the way. <laughs> now, what was funny when I got shot that day, She, the police pulled up because I thought I had ripped my titty on the dough jam at the crack house. See, this, how, this, this is how you take pain and make comedy. No. This is dark as hell. Yeah, so she, so police get there. She like four years old. So they said, what happened? So, you know, when you a drug dealer, you don't tell what happened. So I said, no. Nah. So Ashley just busts. I said, well, my mama shot at Monk, and Monk shot my mama, and her titty fell out. And I was like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> she was like four years old, and she was holding this nigga here by his neck because they was in the cold when I got shot. So she get him out the car, running to the front door of the crack house, dragging her little brother. Wow. Boy, this going <laughs> season five of Snowfall gonna be a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> when they get to Atlanta and Miss Pat take over. Oh, man. This look, it's two episodes man, right here. Right here, this is, this is a season arc. Come on, man, 56K, right here. We this gotta shit. find out who shot her. <laughs> <laughs> if we turn on to any one of them power books and anybody getting shot in the titty, we suing. We suing right here. <laughs> That's Miss Pat's story. We will represent, yeah. Don't do that, 50. <laughs> <laughs> Come get me, 50. I wanna be on the power book. I you need to bitch. be on there. Come on. I don't get called for stuff like that. Well, fuck it. We'll shoot our own. Yeah, mm -hmm. I get called for uh, a lot of other stuff, but not that. I don't get called for hood shit. Them white people love you. They trying to steal you away from us, and they think we ain't watching. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff Ross and Joe Rogan and all them white people who got two names. We on y'all ass. <laughs> Theo Bud. Y'all stop trying to steal Miss Pat. What's the little Asian dude, Bobby? Bobby yeah. Lee. Bobby Lee. Yeah, I know you're friends with all of them, Miss Pat. You been on everybody's show. The White Girl Podcast. So, Miss oh, Pat, what are you talking about? Yeah, I Cummins. saw you on there. Whitney Cummings. I thought she was a porn star. Ain't there a porn star named Whitney Cummings? Nah. <laughs> Don't forget about Bert Kreischer. I know oh, you know Bert, him. This is Come a motherfucker on, with no him and uh, goddamn Tom, Tom Segura. Segura. Yeah. yeah. See? I'm, I'm getting ready to do, I'm doing uh, Bert Kreischer Cruise. I'm gonna kick Burt Crash's ass. I, I was just saying Burt Crash called me and asked me to find him a Cadillac. I sent Burt 15 goddamn Cadillacs. I ain't heard back from him yet. <laughs> he just bought something. Oh, I don't know what see, it was. fuck Burt. Out here, you don't want to spend money with me because I'm black. Oh yes, he, he do. bought a hover. I know. Crab. I just gotta throw some. I just gotta throw some motherfucking <laughs> mulligans out there. Them my guys though. They show us he much love. Some wacky, Over there, oh, yeah, two bears, he one cave. He just mentioned you when I was there. I did his cooking show. Word. And he just, he loved I wanted me. to come on that motherfucker where you had dude come over there and roll all them big ass blunts like sushi. The Netflix shit. 
Wasn't you on that? Uh-huh. Yeah, the, at uh, the cabin and shit. What was it called? The cabin. Yeah, I wanted to be on that shit. They ain't called me. I was it, just, it only did one season. I wanted to come up there. This motherfucker had the blunt roller flew in, and they just rolled big ass blunts so all. It was it was amazing. You would have loved it. I was it. on the episode I where would. the bitch was rocking the uh, bowls, beating on the bowls to make yeah. your, your, your oh, body you did, vibrate. Yeah, you did the meditation or something? Yeah, the meditation. Yeah. Stupid shit. They just ripping rich people off. Oh. Yeah, you can get your kids to hit the motherfucking bowls and feel the same thing. Oh. Oh, rich people got money to waste. You should have took Ashley. Huh? You should have took Ashley. Uh, I didn't take Ashley. Take her. I usually don't take Ashley to TV with me. Take her. And they don't pay for Ashley, they just pay for me. Take so. Ashley. I'm telling you, Ashley is an asset. Tell her you bring I can tell your, by the way she though. get down already. <laughs> you can use her skills. Twin. For what? Yeah, I'm telling you, man. Miss Pac-Man. Let me tell you something, Carlos. I really think you should hang out with Ashley. I damn sure will. Yeah. We on the same type of shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you really should. You are be nice riding looking. around with Ashley. been asking and we gave it to y'all. We coming to LA. We coming to LA June 17th at Regent Theater. Doors open at 8 p.m. Show starts at 9 p.m. Please be on time. Twenty-one, twenty years old, right? Yeah. So, for me, Man. with that kind of money, still living in the projects, we had to figure it out. Like, and I'm not speaking for every man. In, the, in the, if I make it to be making two hundred million, nigga, I can make two hundred thousand. I feel like I supposed to fuck any bitch I want. To. So, if Zion, if you want to do that, live your life. That nigga from South Carolina. But I look like being faithful to a porn That's star. That's what I said. Ugly nigga from South Carolina, you better get it in while you can. <laughs> Ain't no way in the hell I let this shit dry. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Let's P. And it's your girl, Dre and Nicole. And you are tuned in to another episode <laughs> where a drunk mind speaks. Show these niggas a trick. Now, they my house. I done took y'all everywhere else. Now, come on over. All them vines and shit. Mold days and shit. Welcome to the pizza ad. What oh, we yeah. got right here? This granddaddy, man. This come on. Um, this what I got for my 40th. I ain't do nothing to it. Usually, I put 40s on everything I got. Um, I ain't do nothing to this, but put some music in there, you know what I'm saying? It come from uh, Napa Valley. The dude sent me pictures of B.B. King and this motherfucking and everything, man. So it's like, Word? yeah. So Did you do the do on it? Did a booty cat. Did you yes, do sir. The do? Woo, you, you was hitting on that joint? <laughs> yeah, 100%. Give him a booty eight all that. Yeah. God damn, okay. That's living the life. When you, when you on the, hold on, when you stand on a blow up mattress and you can get a girl lick your ass, eat your ass, yeah. you a bad, you cold blooded. Hey. Shit, nigga be broken and bitch, man. Think about it. You ever been so broke you just feel like you about to pass away sometime soon? <laughs> <laughs> you be like, I know God ain't got me out here living like this. A Barry a native, you understand me? You got this, you gotta get this monkey off your back, you understand me? <laughs> if you ain't never broke a female off no chicken. <laughs> now it's nothing that you know men should glorify and be proud of, but you know, it's just culture. Right. You know, LA, they got gang culture. Right. Mm -hmm. We definitely Atlanta, have our you know, own tipping program. culture. Mm -hmm. Right. Bay Area, we got this pimping culture. <laughs> yeah. So you mean 
to tell me I've been a lesbian this whole time? <laughs> That's crazy, man. <laughs> Just get my nigga Ashley. She wanted number four. <laughs> my nigga Ashley. <laughs> 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 I tried to give her a real easy name. My name mm-hmm. is Ashley Renee. Because I named her after uh, the Young and the Restless. And there was a lady on there who was sleeping with a married man, Ashley Abbott. That's too feminine, though. I don't think. What they call you in the streets, Ashley? <laughs> now, you know, she got a little stud name, too. They all got code names. What's your code name? <laughs> See? <laughs> <laughs> she, she might be right. With the lowercase d, though. It's a lowercase d. Well, what you talking about? The me, <laughs> I'm tired of my gay daughter. What about my son over there? He's slow. Uh-uh. He ain't slow. He ain't slow. He is not slow. You know what's going on? All that Miss Pat show you giving him, he, he buying some of the best pussy this city has to offer. <laughs> I can tell. He buying some that good, he buying good shit. He buy, now. I be buying no motherfucking pussy. He got a girl. What the fuck that mean? What the fuck it better not mean? I mean you crazy as hell. His mama famous too, got a TV show. They mama ain't famous. She is. When I go home, I'm Patricia Lee. She hey, ain't famous. Well, as long as you give him the money, it's Miss Pat. Now, I'm not giving him a I motherfucking thing. Miss Pat money. <laughs> Don't act like you ain't gave him shit. He a grown man. Whatever you gave him is extra anyway. That's fuck off money. He supposed to buy a little Magic City pussy with it. He, he ain't never Keep been Keep doing that your city. thing, Miss Pat, son. Oh, Real nigga like know. fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> nah, this is anywhere around her. He be all that Magic City. He on the phone. He about to get on the phone now. I don't know what he talking about. Exactly. What you mean? <laughs> <laughs> it ain't came out yet, but when it do, I don't know what he was talking <laughs> you know I call OB playing. So, so I hate really when crazy. I was 15 and when I'm in the streets with him, everybody think that's my man. Mm. I hate that shit too. <laughs> you think he, he like it? Huh? <laughs> you think he like it? <laughs> and that's your lady. Man, don't fucking play with me like that. <laughs> <laughs> Do you not see this lady in my sister shape just like that? <laughs> 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 fuck is my lady? <laughs> uh. Everybody think we fucking. They like, ooh, I like your chocolate drop. I said, that's my motherfucking son, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga ain't no chocolate drop. Then Ashley show up. If anybody fuck with me, you <laughs> 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 my titties. <laughs> <laughs> so fucking stupid, Carlo. <laughs> hey, Quish. You might you gotta stand up. Been sitting down for a minute. I don't want you to smush that new boot hole. <laughs> That's what get it stained, sitting on it. <laughs> You gotta walk it out. (laughs) Don't never sit longer than an hour. (laughs) See, that's what. (laughs) Oh my God. That's gonna call the purplish. That's where the discoloration comes from. Are you sitting on a leather seat? (laughs) That's your problem. Question We can't do club no more. In the big leagues now. You mind if we use your picture on our brochure? (laughs) (laughs) We actually use you on our logo. They got an asshole, her asshole, that's a logo. Oh, you want the question? <laughs> <laughs> you want the question? We're in the special now. You can get the question if you sign up for the subscription. We can do six hundred dollars right now. How are your kids no don't tax. watch this shit? Uh, how are your kids? Oh no, we are sorry. Oh, they definitely watch this shit. This is the number one show amongst black people between the ages of four. In 81. Four? Yeah. Mm-hmm. We got a whole uh, another group of people who watch the show. We got some infants. Like, I don't know if you have young children or you just had a baby. Trust me, turn this shit on and put them in front of it. They going to sleep. They don't need the, they don't need the context. It's the sound of our voices at the, the timing and the pacing. It's really soothing to newborns and infants. Mm. It's been proven. Cats love this show. Pit bulls, especially. I get videos all the time of people sending me their animals and they just really tune in and watch what we got going on. Oh, that's awesome. White people too. White people fuck with this shit. I get a lot of white people uh, come to the show and be like, I, seen you on, I saw you on 85 South. Yeah, they fuck with us I on the I get a low. lot of yeah. people that saw me on 85 South. Thank you, audience. I appreciate that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Y'all continue to love and support everybody you see on this come stage on. and this show. And if you see Ashley in the streets, make sure you show her a lot of love. Give her a titty to rub. 
<laughs> We're gonna start a foundation called Titties for Ashley. <laughs> she don't need no more color. <laughs> exactly. Rub what a titty, make a wish. <laughs> Who? The Rubber Titty Foundation. <laughs> Not the rubber titty foundation. Some of the make a wish kids wish is just the rubber titty. You think you so? Not, yeah, some of them probably. They probably don't even allow that. You know, uh, well, I had a special need unc uncle that my granddad would always give him buying pussy. That's that's love. But I, you know, I, I look at you know when, when dealing with my uncle as a kid because my granddad bought him pussy every Friday and every Friday. Every Friday. That's a treat. <laughs> I wish somebody loved me that much. That's probably the only thing that kept him in check. <laughs> but I think I think people think because people are special need, they don't want to be sexual active, but they do want to be sexual active. Yeah, but I think it's against the law to be fucking on them, man. No. <laughs> what? It's no. not how would you they can fuck? You mean to tell me that they grown and they can't fuck just because they uncle would cripple. No, he wrong. wasn't. He fucked there Friday. <laughs> he, <laughs> he was, was crippled, crippled Monday through Thursday. No, he was crippled and he was Friday, fresh and that nigga was normal. Hey, what's up, Pop? What time we going? <laughs> <laughs> I took my shower and everything. <laughs> 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 nigga straighten up. <laughs> I don't need no walk. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have no fucking walk. <laughs> not on Friday, As <laughs> soon as he done, fuck it. Go get my wheelchair. <laughs> my back. I'm a back. Y'all so fucking stupid. Pop, walk me to the car, man. That is not what fucking happened. Got damn back done went out on me. <laughs> <laughs> you walked up in there, you know how it go. Hey. <laughs> Tried to break her back, broke my. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor said I need a back yard. Oh, <laughs> so fucking yeah. stupid. <laughs> oh. Forgive him, y'all. I was gonna tell my special knee uncle, son. Hey, oh, you, tell him. He uh, wanna hear it. But I mean, oh. I told him on my special, but my granddad was buying pussy every Friday and, and, and it kept him, he thought it he thought it helped with the seizure, but you know. It did. I love holistic medicine. <laughs> 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 hey man, if something ever wrong with me, just do that. Just keep giving me different kinds of pussy until something start working. Please. Did he try putting it on his face? Are you allergic to penicillin? Maybe. <laughs> How you gonna give it to me? Well, we just gonna put it in the pussy. No, let's try it. Let's, <laughs> let's try it. Let's see what happened, man. Oh, uh, if you insist. Yeah. Oh, shit. I didn't think of it as a list of medicine, but it could have been. It is. Pussy definitely got medicine in it. It probably, if, if, if I think that would be with a lot of them school shootings and the mass shootings. What? Like, some of them dudes, be, they be talking about because they couldn't get a woman or some shit, man. They need, hey, man. The mass shooters. Buy you some pussy. You know, I, really, somebody should open a, a place called Bust a Nut, and then you, you just go. have pussy behind a wall, and yeah. you pay a fee to get in, and then they can just hit all the pussies that they want. Now, they can be prostate pussies. But that's what I'm saying. At some point, they're going to have to. <laughs> it's not real. They're going to have to legalize real prostitution. Pussy. Uh, they gonna have to legalize prostitution, like some medicinal prostitution. Yeah, man, my my my, my Glock. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, I can't see it. Unless I, I got a uh, uh, man. I got uh, social paralysis. The fuck is social paralysis? That's why I, I get so scared uh, around people. I can't say nothing. You know, some people need one of them little dogs. <laughs> I just need a little pussy. <laughs> I think it'll really help with the sleep apnea. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh. I'm glad pussy is natural medicine. It is. I wish people had, you know, they always want people to have access to good, you know, like health care and public resources. I want everybody to have access to a little piece of pussy every now and then. Good clean pussy. Good clean yeah. Like we need a, a like a, a place with a good reputation that's known for having good pussy. You just said like the Walmart of Coochie. Bust a nut. Bust a nut. And they got a drive through. No, nah, you shouldn't be a drive drive through too freaking. <laughs> they got them line to be all the way down the street. No, they working like Chick Fil A. They, they be out there. Ain't no way. Ain't no way they gonna they be, be getting out there already. What a pad. How you want your pussy with flowers, mm -hmm. yolks, yogurt, pickles? Mm -mm. You want butter on your pussy? Yeah, man, make a hit. <laughs> no, no. It's that meat. extra meat. I feel like that's somewhere you gonna have to be buzzed in, and they gonna have to see your ID. You shouldn't be able to just pull you up. Right. 
Your name got to be in the database. It ain't going to be fast food. Uh, it looks like you're a new customer here. We're going to have to get some blood work, and uh, you'll be able to come back in two weeks if everything comes up. And what two would it cost? Two what weeks. Would it cost? What would it cost? To get in, the initial membership is going to sound ridiculous. Because you, it's, it's a, yeah, you got to pay the initial. It's going to be up in there. It might be a thousand or two. Oh, a thousand. Just to get in the database. Because then you can go to uh, air, all 20, over the 000. city. 20,000. Because it's like a buffet. Get all you want once no, you get in. No, see, that's what's, that's, that's oh, the problem. 20,000 right one time, all you can get? Yeah. A lifetime membership? No, six months. Oh, oh. hell no. That ain't even a good deal no more. <laughs> 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 Nigga got to sell his house to get in this shit? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you selling your truck? Nigga, I'm trying to get in the hey, club. Yeah, I, got, I, got, I got a little thing going on. <laughs> Nigga, you trying to get in the database? No, hell no. Man, I'm, I'm already get, in the database. I, I, I get what? I just got to renew <laughs> my subscription. <laughs> Listen, I got 24 hours to come up with $7,000. Or they going to break my dick. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, no man, they, they got my nuts down there in the freezer. <laughs> I got to pay my pussy bills. I two more pieces of paperwork and my social security card is supposed to come back. <laughs> we kicking it all the next week if y'all want to. <laughs> Sound like um, you guys been there. <laughs> hell no. Oh, no. I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. That's, that's a lot. That's a lot. 20000 Got to be at least 600 dude. That's the price of booty hole. I'm saying, like, you got it. <laughs> That's the goal. Yeah, you buy a whole right? new booty hole for 600 man. That's temporary. It's going to fade back. What you think they're doing with the old ones? <laughs> <laughs> Reselling them. <laughs> Refurbishing them like are iPhone. Crazy. <laughs> Y'all ain't got nothing back there, dude. Nah, man, you know pickup is Wednesday. What can we uh, expect from the next season of Miss Pat's show? What you, you got in there? Um, surprises. I, we got a lot of surprises. You can't tell us. No, I can't tell you. I Damn. know that. No. I knew it. And, um, you know. Give us a hint. Give the people a hint. You know. It's going to be funny. It's going to be funny. We, we trust that. Yeah. I mean, you I can't earn, give yeah. away the fucking show. It's going to be funny. Yeah, and I got some it. other things I'm working on, too. I sold another show and some other things. Oh, okay. So coming down the pipeline, but... That's what's up. You know, because I'm in the four, I'm going into the, you know, next season of the Miss Pat show. So things are starting to get... You get about five, six, you know. Right. So it's on to the next thing. Yeah. I've been... I mean, I'm thankful. You know, if, if it go past four, if it go past five or six, I'm... It was a show that wasn't supposed to last, so... Wasn't even supposed to get out there, so I'm... I'm, I'm just thankful as hell. Well, you know not... Might as well enjoy yourself. You know your car getting broke into tonight. I ain't never did it like this before. We are shooting a special, and you is doing your OnlyFans content on stage. Yeah. I'm trying to get some more followers. Just do what you shake, 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 shake. Oh, man, shake, 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 shake. Make the whole crowd shake, 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 shake. Daddy had me with six to one. When he nutted, bro, wasn't nobody in there with me. It was just me. You was the only sperm. I was like, so don't nobody want to come? Okay, shit. This is easy. <laughs> Make some noise. Shake, 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 shake. I'm oh, through smoking play. weed. That shit ain't got too strong. Why you say that? Because I was high the other day. Ordered a pregnancy pillow. <laughs> <laughs> the one that you lay between the legs. That, that ain't really a bad idea. I'm at home taking naps like I'm 10 months. <laughs> Nowadays, shows only ain't got to go nowhere. You know, shows come and take three, four years off and then come back on with... Yeah. With, come back, so you can come back to it, you know? Yeah. If you choose to. Yeah. What's, what you want to do that you ain't did yet or that's, like, top of your list? Yeah, who you want to have on there that you ain't had on there yet? Come on on, Ice Cube. You know I, I love me some Ice Cube. Come on. Yeah, and I'm a big Ice Cube fan. I always had a crush on him. 
No, I mean, not like that, but... Well, I, ain't I, 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 your I, husband I, ain't going to leave you now. <laughs> <laughs> your husband going to come out the house hey, that day. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, I got mean, your motherfucking ice cube. <laughs> cube ice cube in his goddamn sweet And cube your goddamn ice. I'll tell you that. Get in the car. Pat, hell, Patricia, one, both of y'all. Uh, <laughs> Go ahead, this nigga up here on a Friday. I mean, <laughs> you know, the, goddamn, hey, hey, if I was still at the General Motors, goddamn it, hey. The General Motors. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I mean, you know, um, I, we we gonna have some really good guest stars this year, so uh, looking I'm looking forward to, forward to that. I'm excited. I really am. So, but the things I would like to do, I would like to do more movies. Okay. I like to create movies. Ooh, what show? If you could have any, what character? Like, what type of character do you want to play? Ideally, in your head. I would like to really do something serious. I want to see you play a church lady. Uh, that's easy for a big black woman, Carlos. From the hood. All them bitches from the that's hood. That's old crack. All them bitches, they sold pussy. I sold crack. That's the difference. Yeah. Prostitutes ain't ain't the best actresses. Drug dealers can act. <laughs> they got to. <laughs> Serious situation. Yeah. You gotta, act like, you gotta act like you ain't selling drugs. You gotta act like the dope good when you know it ain't shit. Come oh, on, man. Right. Fuck with me. I mean, I, I would I would take you. I, I love comedy because, you know, we're comedians. So anytime we get in comedy roles, that's just like us really performing. Yeah. So, but I would love to do something dramatic. We make some of the best serious actors, too, I think. I don't yeah. think we get a lot of opportunities to do it, but I think when we get the shot, I mean, look at Eddie. Yeah. yeah. Shit. Eddie don't need every damn thing. No. You know, I'm trying to think of other comedians that big like Eddie that I don't think nobody did as many movies as Eddie as a comedian. Nah, that's the GOAT. Yeah. 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 I mean, even even uh, Chris Tucker. Chris Tucker? Yeah. Kevin Hart. Jamie oh, Foxx. Oh, damn, Kevin Hart. Jamie Foxx? Yeah, and Jamie, Jamie Foxx. Fox. Really crazy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Comedians be doing Jim Carrey that. on the low. Jim, like, my husband with, love everything wow. Jim Carrey did. I mean, he got a lot of time to watch movies. He did the house a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I know he got a theater. <laughs> he do have a theater. Yeah. Did you know they wrote the mask in Miami? <laughs> <laughs> At Dan Marino's house. It's, it's on the extended cut of the DVD. <laughs> a lot of catching up since I left the General Motors. A lot you, know of what, up. you know what I hate about my husband being retired? It's because he's my husband is 52 and he listens to the TV really loud. And I'm like, nigga, you don't work around machines no more. Why the fuck is this TV on 99? And he only watched black and white movies. And, and he said he expect, you know, I'm a hood bitch. I don't wanna see no motherfucking Bay Roof suit uh, uh motherfucking playing baseball. I'm like, dude, everybody dead. The audience dead, the announcer dead, the players dead. The fuck is you watching this old shit? I'm surprised that he can show up on the fucking TV. But you be quiet so I can see who won this shit. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's rap footage, baby. You, you don't get to see the word shit, series. Years ago. <laughs> Come on now. I'm like, everything, I walk, I came home last night, this nigga watched that's the black the hell and white. That scared the hell out of me, it's 40. He 52 and can't hear shit and watch a, damn, that's the thing. I do it while black and white. I'm like, do you know this TV come in color? Why the fuck are you watching this black and white TV, nigga? Black and white got to look crazy in HD. No, he love it. I mean, he be watching all them actors. I don't know who the fuck they are at the height of they they at the, they was the shit when they were back in fifty two. How he know about this shit? Oh, he he read two years ain't that long ago. No, nah, but he 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 like old shit. He love old shit. I'm like, uh, I, I, I mean, he fall asleep with this shit. I'm like, nigga. So I be on the phone. My friend be like, do your old ass husband listen to this shit on loud? Every old nigga listens to the TV loud. Just loud. I mean, I be in the other room, I be like, turn the goddamn TV down, Gary. What you say? I said, baby, can you turn the TV down? Yeah, you know that. be up so loud. <laughs> you don't want to hear that shit. He just be trying to see if he's going to say something. Turn that goddamn TV. Who you talking to? <laughs> <laughs> I motherfucking thought so. <laughs> you ain't worked all them goddamn years at that planet. Turn this motherfucker up loud as I want to. Me, oh, Humphrey, go, Humphrey Bogart, the greatest motherfucker ever. Watch what he tell Cruella DeVille. <laughs> that, that's what he be saying too, nigga. He be watching Humpty Grove Art. Yeah, Humpty Bogart. Just looking at you, kid. 
I'm like, like you ain't never watched Casablanca? Nigga, I don't watch nothing. It's the greatest movie shit. ever made. Nigga, if it's, it's in not, color. but it, that's what they say. That's it's what a, they say. It's a good ass white people when movie. they wasn't making movies. Yeah. This shit was good till they started I mean, making movies. That's sometimes I come in and he be watching shit. I don't know where he get this shit from. When they didn't even talk on TV, they just act. Yeah. I'm like, I said, what the fuck is wrong with you? This Nobody man, you, watches you this shit. You have drove that man completely crazy. No, that man, I, 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 he, the man is always, when you I met the man. 31 years? Yeah, when I met him, he was watching Seinfeld. One no niggas in the streets watching Seinfeld. That shit was terrible. I don't know how that shit lasted that long. <laughs> Comedians, they all be on all these platforms kissing ass, talking about that shit is good. That shit is terrible. You know what, Carlos? I ain't gonna lie to you. I thought it was some some white folks shit. It is. No, I watched that shit one day. It's funnier than a motherfucker. Hell and you no. gotta be unhigh. See, the problem uh -uh. with you, you go in there, you watching that shit. I'm high. finna smoke now, cause you got me stressed the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> ain't no way I'm finna find that shit funny. I tried. I tried many times. I don't get it. <laughs> I'm telling you, Carlos, if you really sit down and watch it, it's funny. Fuck no. Somebody yeah, sent is. me a it's clip of that shit. Fun. I was like, man. That shit, I don't know what it is. I just felt I just, and shit. I just felt the whole show was racist. What? They didn't even talk about niggas. I don't I know. That's exactly. Why, that's why you felt like. And then the little fat hey, nigga was me. selling all them pretzels. Like something about pretzels I just don't fuck with. Who sold pretzels? The little bald nigga. I ain't never seen him sell no motherfucking pretzels. He was the pretzel man. Yeah. From Roll Go. Oh, he was on a commercial. Oh, yeah, yeah, he yeah, was yeah. the pretzel. He said, come on, don't play with me, man. Don't play with me. I've been here, Kate. You been had cable? Been had cable. Well, you know, my, my, that, that's what made me really like him, because he liked Seinfeld. Who? And, and my husband read the newspaper every day. I had never met a nigga that could read. He didn't have a choice. Huh? The internet wasn't popping like that. Yeah, so he read yeah, the newspaper. Yeah, other nigga was selling dope and getting ba bitches pregnant. I met a black man with no fucking kids. That was a miracle. That's a miracle? Back in the old day. Yeah, there's a bunch of niggas out here with no babies. Those are niggas that ain't claiming them. No, nah, this is a bunch of niggas out here who don't have none. Ted Bundy, how many kids you got? Zero. That nigga ain't got no kids. Oh. <laughs> you the bomb. You the bomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you right, Ted Bundy, eight niggas. I'm sorry. You don't look like you eat. You don't even have a dog. <laughs> what? He don't even have a dog. A gold? A dog. Well, he shouldn't have a dog. Man, he ain't got shit. He just him. <laughs> just him in a gym bag. <laughs> <laughs> he the type of nigga to get pulled over by the police and get beat up. Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> he ain't gonna get pulled over. He ain't that type of nigga. He ain't... <laughs> I mean, he ain't do shit. They just, he looks suspicious. He a nigga to us. Man, he ain't a nigga to them like that. Oh, yeah, he's No, safe. he like a college student. He's straight. They he look very intelligent. He a nice looking guy. I, I'm not gonna agree to that shit. I guarantee if you haircut, if you gave him a haircut and shave, I wouldn't I bet give he's a fuck gorgeous. if he ever gave a haircut again. I don't care what that nigga do with his life. <laughs> how, old, how old are you, baby? Oh, yeah. Ashley, you can turn straight. That's your age. <laughs> <laughs> Ashley, Ugh, that's nasty. That's harassment. No, you play. <laughs> you don't have to take this, Joe. <laughs> you don't have to take this. <laughs> Damn. See how they laugh when they abuse black men? That's black men abuse funny. <laughs> he said, you see how they want to abuse black men? Hell yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, Joe. She want to peg everybody, nigga. <laughs> you ain't shit, cause that nigga lean back and like, yeah, that's my sister. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what we do, that's what we do. Hey, old pig leg ass, <laughs> old pig leg ass. <laughs> oh, you think it's crazy. He laid back, boy, Ashley ain't changed a bit, boy. <laughs> I love my sister, bro. He's like, she pull out dicks bigger than mine. Damn. That's crazy, uh -oh. Ashley. Uh, we gonna keep you lifted in prayer though. The summer coming up, one of these niggas might catch you slipping. You never know, Ash. You never know. This might be your breakout year, Ash. Yeah, I need her. You know what? I need her knocked up like the brat. For real? Knocked up She's like the brat. She's a good-looking woman too. Got some nice titties on her. Nice titties, real ones too. Sit up high. Tell she a good person because they firm. The brat. 
No, Ashley. Oh. <laughs> Ashley had gave me a side hug, and then you know how like a titty smush, but that little titty. No, you, your titty. titty. Your titty. Yeah. Nice we titty. We talking about you. Look at him. They sit on the lap now. Ashley, you were just very strange today. I don't know what <laughs> what you had for lunch or what. Or what but you I didn't think, have. Yeah, I think it's about time you go and lay down and get you a nap. <laughs> <laughs> or have a Snickers or something, because you're not yourself right now, Ashley. You're not yourself when you're hungry. Yeah, you're not yourself when you're hungry. <laughs> Somebody get her a Red Bull and a Yoo-Hoo. <laughs> not a Red Bull and a Yoo-Hoo. need some energy and some protein. Ah. <laughs> uh. Well, Miss Pat, we're gonna wrap this up before Ashley fuck somebody in here. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I don't want that on me. You Ooh. feel me? Ooh, I don't know what I she might pull out of the bag. What? <laughs> I appreciate that. Make sure y'all go watch the third season of the Miss Pat Show. It's streaming now on BT Plus, and it's also on BET on Linear, and it's on VH1. So make sure y'all go check me out. Three channels. Yeah, yeah. Three Let's channels. go. Yeah. Hey, before we leave, I want everybody to know. Ashley got a deal though that she keep in a guitar case. Yeah. 85 South Show, Miss Pat. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Hilarious. We take pictures? Yeah, we gotta it take pictures. Hilarious. Stand up. Yeah. Hell yeah. You Fuck. so stupid. <laughs> Y'all so stupid. Get my eyelashes about to fall off. now showing you just how important having the 85 South Show app is because you was watching this show thinking, oh, they done finally put the shit back on YouTube. No. They was listening. We weren't. We weren't. It's on the app. It's on the app. The rest of this, listen, the rest of the audio is on the app. Now you gotta know what we Woo. said, you gotta go get the app. That's the 85 South Show app. It's available on Amazon, Five Stick, Apple TV, wherever you get your subscription. No, it's not. It's, it's just, not on Apple it's TV. It's just available directly where they sell apps. Oh, they don't sell apps on Apple TV? It's well, y'all should fuck with us too, Apple TV. Roku. Hell wrong with y'all. It fuck is Roku. on there. Put it on Roku. Don't say fuck nobody. No, I didn't say fuck them. I said put it, I thought we fuck with them. Oh, we do. My house full of Rokus. Oh. The Roku the most everywhere. Yeah. So subscribe to the app. It's only $8.99 a month or $85 a year. So you get a whole year for $85. Did yeah. you know that? It's $8.50 and then you gotta pay tax. Yeah, so you know, it's but eight. You know, we get them all type of content. You know what, we not even gonna tell them who you got your glasses from until they get it on the app. I mean, hey, you gotta watch the, the app. The app is available. All of these people that say we should keep putting this on YouTube for free, what about the years of freeness that we've already provided upon you? We gave this away for Let's free for years. Let's move together. Why would you let somebody come year. invest in the show and put it on another network and you're buying their subscription? You don't ask them why you're buying their shit. So don't ask us. We're putting it on the app. Who's over the app? Nobody knows. Get the app. Yeah. We saw what you said in the comments. Sure we saw it. We saw everybody. The good, the we bad. Got somebody to read every fucking comment. And the ugly. So you know what? We folding under this pressure. Sure we hear you. We heard you. We hear you. We win indeed.
We'll yeah, just get the fuck on that y'all way. Just for an hour though. Yep. That's yep. all you get is an hour. So don't you can't complain. Well, where the rest of it I at? I think they should get 37 minutes. Oh, see, we gotta hurry up. We should up. put a whole bunch of ads in between, like long ass ads, like five minute ads. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Uh, you, you. Slow motion ads. Slow, slow it down. <laughs> Waste a motherfucking time. Yeah, uh, let's just, uh, Go ahead and make sure. Channel85.com. I want to make sure I read what they wrote. They wrote some shit out for us. These niggas don't know how to spell or type proper sentences, but they trying get to get us to get y'all to buy the app. What, you think we want to read this shit? Channel85, man. So we can talk that shit, man. Ladies, don't you like this deep thrust? Go get it on the app. Yeah. That's right. On the app. Uncensored, unfiltered, and edited. Can you believe that? I'm talking about with actual production in it. Thanks. Jump cuts, yep. clips, all types of types of like exclusive shit that they don't even know that we did. They don't even know that we got a show where we be cooking like exotic foods and shit. Okay. That's on the we app. Got a sport show. Yep. Talk show, documentary. Chico got a handwriting class that he teach. <laughs> Nobody passed it. Cause Nobody. that's why the shit look like right. this. But we're working on it, and you can see it on the app. They didn't, the e- app. didn't even tell them about the tax course that we had uploaded on there. No they don't even know that we, we got we a whole show about Wall Street. And a $5,000 on the app. Right. <laughs> and we got the alternate ending to the color purple up there. Oh, right. man. No we got the raw edition, all the uncut, all the bloopers. We got all that. Right. It's on the yeah. app. So if you want to see some shit that, you know, they trying to hide from you. Go to that. I'm leaving though. Channel85.com. Go get the app. You got an hour for free. We gave you what you wanted. Now give us some subscriptions to the app. $8.50. Eight ninety nine dollars with tax. $85 a year. Channel85.com. 85 South Show. Get the app. Well, see, this is what they don't know. The app really $3, but adjusted for inflation is $8.90. Yeah. With low C. Get the app, man. Stop bullshitting. We out of here, man. We're not about to keep working all this time for. We are going on out, baby. We are going on out. We on your way to fly. On air.